Hitler's triumphal arch was planned to take pride of place. The highway would have been built up and elevated so that the top of the cylinder would have been under the new level of the ground. Towering nearly 400 feet, the arch would carry the names of Germany's 1.8 million fallen of the First World War, engraved upon its walls. It stood at the end of one of the two massive boulevards that were central to Hitler's plan. This north-south axis would run from the arch to the largest covered space in the world, the Great Hall. It would be intersected by an east-west axis, with colossal structures erected along its stretch. 